before war start, God tell me war will be in Ukraine. And I was telling people, you need to be ready. And they was like, no, no, no. You, you say something strange. Uh, Russia will not attack Ukraine. It was five o'clock in the morning. My family was sleeping. The windows start shaking. And I tell my wife, take kids and go to West Ukraine. There is more safety. And she said, no, I will stay with you. Everything what happened with you will happen with me. I want to go through this uh, with you. We was expecting 50 people to our church. We bring mattress pillows to our church and we was waiting. But there was more than 50 people. And next day it was 110. It was not members of our church, it was neighbors who was running and they was looking for a hiding place. And we say, yes, yeah, sure, you can come. In this room there were about 80 people. There were mattresses and there was no way to go. There were moments when there didn't have food, there was very little. And we couldn't drink it anymore. We gave them just a piece of bread. People came and asked, can we еще 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 и все сидели и вспоминали то время, когда мы могли читать им. During the war time, God take our kids in his hand. Because we receive shoebox from Operation Christmas Child one month before war. Usually we receive it in March. But here we receive it earlier. Здесь была Наташа, директор из Крестной школы, и она приняла решение раздать детям подарочки. И каждому ребенку дали по подарку. И было время каждому сказать о Христе, потому что в основном неверующие были. It was like holidays for them. They forget about the war. They forget about explosion, what was outside. They was running on the hall. They was showing the present. And people who prepared this box, they put uh, very important things inside, what we need in that time. It was flashlights, toothbrushes, drawing pencils, so kids use it all the time. Even what we need to fix our stuff, like generator, we find in that shoes box. Uh, God knew what we need, and he gave this uh, idea what to put to that people who prepared. <laughs> It was a difficult time, it was a scary time, but in the same way it's perfect time to share the gospel. The people was open, very open. They want to hear gospel. They say, tell more. <laughs> we want to we wanna pray, we want to sing the song. Yes. God used this time to, to be that light in this world. No matter what's happening around us, we need to keep that peace. And people will see this peace in our heart, they, they want to take this peace too. And you can meet them with Jesus in this way. Give them this peace and meet them with Jesus. It's very important for Christians. Be light in this world. And I want to encourage you, if you go through hard time, because we all the time go through hard time, some harder, maybe very hard, but God will lead you through this situation. Don't be afraid. Yeah. <laughs>